Hi, this is my first video. I, a few days ago, got this machine out of the dump. I was going to the dump dropping off some recyclables and I saw this right next to the bin. It is an Admiral Deluxe. Uh, I believe it was manufactured in 1952. And it comes in this nifty cabinet. And here's the top of the cabinet. Carrying case, whatever you want to call it. There's the inside. It sits right on top and, it, and latches onto that base. Here's a little drawer for bobbins and doodads. It's in considerably good condition. There's some hinges and a hinge there, or a latch there, and a latch there, and the handle. It's all in good shape. This is the machine. Now, when I picked it up, the only thing that was wrong with it was the plug needed to be replaced, and because it looked a little chewed up, and the belt needed to be replaced. The belt was seven dollars. There you can see the belt attaching to the motor in the back. And there's the motor. And uh, the plug cost me 25 because I didn't know what I was doing. So they had, I had to hire, hire somebody to replace the plug. I know that's lame, but what are you gonna do? So I'm still, I still got a pretty cheap machine. And it runs like a dream. And uh, I will show you. All right, let me put it down to forward. And my thread just popped off because I don't think I had it on right. Oh, no, wait. Well, anyway, I'll show you what I got done here. This, of course, is just scrap. But there's the stitching. And here's stitching that I did before. And it's on there real tight. So this is probably going to be my new machine. This one was my old machine. But this one works real nice and it's very smooth. So I think I'm going to... I'm going to use this one from now on. I'll show you the in, the guts in a minute, but I don't know if this was um, original to the machine, but it has a ton of accessories. I have no idea what that is, or any of this other stuff. It is all a mystery, so I got to learn about that. Luckily, it did come with this book, Directions for Using This Set of Attachments. So, came in this box. Sewing machine. So that uh, came with it. And some free bobbins, which I was like thrilled about. Some little metal ones. Okay, now this thing weighs a ton, so let me see if I can one-handedly get it up there. Ouch. The bulb is actually original too. The bulb. Wait. What the heck? There we go. The bulb never wore out from 1950-something. There we go. All right. Well, I can keep it up there. That is the internal mechanism of this machine. Now, I downloaded the manual. Mom, why is this wet? I don't know. I downloaded the manual. Is this, is this from somebody that you... Here. Had? Willow, can you hold on a minute? Sure, you can. Go ahead. So that was the underneath. And, uh, 
how to download the manual from some manual site, but it's absolutely worthless. Okay, so it was $189.50 full cash price back in 1952. So it must be a pretty decent machine. And, uh, but it doesn't give you a whole lot of information. Like, if anybody watching knows this machine, maybe you can tell me what this is. It turns counterclockwise, <coughs> but I have no idea what it is. And also, this thing up here. No idea what that does. You would think there'd be a parts list in the manual, but there is not a parts list. The things that are wrong with this machine. Let's see. It does not thread a bobbin. It does not uh, do that because this piece here is supposed to turn. It's supposed to hold this and turn this. And it's supposed to turn uh, by... Uh, you're supposed to be able to turn that either towards you or away from you, whatever, and it will make the needle stop. It does not do that. It is frozen. It is stuck frozen. And I've tried to unscrew it. Because there's some screw there. Tried to unscrew it so I could get the guts out and oil it maybe and put it back together. It does not work. It's frozen solid. So I'm using my old one, my new old one, old new one, to to thread the bobbin, or to wind the bobbin, I don't know, whatever you want to call it. Okay, anyway, anybody has some comments? This is my first video, be kind. Um, and uh, yeah, that's it. Just, it's cool, isn't it? Alright, thanks, bye.